And the early days when you were in, I don't know, were you in rep? I know you were at the yes. Everyman Theatre. You were I in, was in, in Liverpool, Liverpool yeah. Well, that must have been pretty crazy back then, because what period we're we talking about? Oh, early 70s? We were wild. I mean, never do. I don't, I don't think young actors ever. I mean, we, I, I, we used to do pub shows when I'd drink about four pints of Guinness before we started and through the show. And I was only like thin tiny. as a rake and yeah. tiny. Yeah. And other things were. I, taken. I, I heard. <laughs> You, you took LSD before going on stage once? Well, I, I wasn't really before going on stage. I didn't realise that I would still be suffering the effects when I went on stage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So who gave you that? Well, so, I, I can't tell you who's involved. <laughs> they might, the police might come. <laughs> but it was a... Uh, them or something. But a party or something? It, well, it was in the, in the bistro at the Everyman Theatre downstairs. There were a lot of old reprobates down there. Yeah. And, we, you know, they used to come down every night. And this guy said, do you want a bit of malarkey? I thought she was chatting me up. I said, no, I'm sorry. You know, and he said, no, oh, no, heaven, a tiny piece of heaven. Wow. I said, I, I, where is it? And he said, a nice little party all of your own. <laughs> you know? which, which member of the Beatles was this? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not telling you. <laughs> anyway, so he gave me and he brought out this tiny thing, a little teeny bit that looked like a piece of lead out of a pencil. This would be a dot on yeah. a piece of paper. Yes, you obviously know. And so I thought, oh, go on. I, thought it, well, I just thought it would be like a bit of fun. I've never tried LSD. Oh, well, I don't so know. was it...? Oh, yeah, well, I took it. I thought, oh, to hell with it. Took it. And then we said, right, we're going to go off on the town. I said, OK, yeah. And I thought, I could see them going, oh, wow. Oh, wow, man. It was 1974. Oh, wow. <laughs> and all this was going on. I thought, oh, for God's sake, I don't feel anything. And then I bent down to do my shoe up, and the world went red. <laughs> right, <laughs> red. Oh, my God. I lifted my head up, and it was sucked back into my head. And everything was normal again. Oh, Jesus. You know, it started. Wow. And then we all went, we all went to my flat, and um, <laughs> I was lying on my bed, and on the wall was a poster of Marilyn Monroe. It was a famous one of her doing this yeah. to the camera. And... Anyway, so I was just lying there looking at it, and it was juddering about a bit. You know, like, was doing a bit of this. <laughs> and then suddenly, out of her mouth came her tongue. Wow. Only it Ooh. wasn't like a tongue, it was like a snake's tongue. It was black oh. and forked, and it went... Oh. ..all over her face. And I said, look at that, can you look at that? And they said, what? Because they couldn't see anything, obviously. Yeah. It was just me. I remember, I remember there were these things, wow. retinal circuses, that you saw. So I thought, oh, that's what it is. Anyway, I took notes and I looked away from it. But out of the corner of my eye, it was still doing it. I even out of the corner of my eye. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Wow. Really cheap hearing. Yeah. I had a matinee of a children's show the next day. That had to go in and do it. What were you doing on stage? Pig in the Jungle. With, um, it was a children's show, Brian Patton. Right, uh, yeah. It was him, and I played an elephant in it. I think we have a photograph of you in that elephant suit on stage. There, <laughs> I think. So that's, me. that's pretty scary. <laughs> but so that's you in the elephant suit. That's me. I mean, so, who needs acid? I know. Jonathan Ross here. You're watching the Jonathan Ross Show YouTube channel. This is behind the scenes stuff. We're going to try and do some more of this. But of course, I think this will be a great time to introduce you to one of tonight's guests. Gordon Ramsay is right here. Big Gordon. Yes. And you've got to... to the last Jonathan Ross show ever. <laughs> <laughs> Bring it on. <laughs>